Well, hello everyone, and welcome here to Don't Starve. Since the last episode, as I had a little bit of time before it got dark, I got us back over uh, to the base. What should we try? Let's try one of those fish, because they seem to be starting to go bad. So, we got some silk the last episode. We got a couple of pieces. We had four here already, so let's make use of that. Let's make ourselves a delightful top hat. And, uh, buying a top hat, making a top hat means that we can start thinking about making the press the hat a tater. Uh, let's have a quick look here. I'd love to make a pan flute. Uh, I'd like to make the fire staff. Now, for some reason, it's only showing me the ice staff. We'll have a look at that. Anyway, let's see what we need for the Presta Hat Stator and concentrate on that. We need four rabbits and we need four boards. Oh, let's not wear the hat. Because we want to build with it. So, today we need bunnies and we need wood. There's three of the bunnies automatically. And three. Let's make ourselves another trap. And we'll put that up here. Oh, there's the fourth bunny. Okay, we're going to make the Presta Hatitator and then get some wood. I was originally going to get some wood and then make the Presta Hatitator. But, best laid plans and all that. Okay, so back here. And in you know, the age for a fine one, eight. Ah, too short. Okay, I didn't want to harvest this this early, but I think I have no choice. There's my second. There we go. Excellent. All right. So we're definitely going to need wood now. So, we'll find out one board, and that allows us to make the press to Hattitator. And we shall put that right there. Okay, and that's. Good lord, it's starting to freeze really fast. We have no choice but to use twigs. That's where oh we're in the earmuffs, good lord. Come on, give us a bit of heat. Let's just get that up a step. Alright, we're starting to see yep, yeah, we're starting to see now that probably grown a bit more. We're starting to see that uh, we're really going to struggle for cold. This is this this is Wilson's advantage. Uh, Willow's advantage is her sanity is incredibly durable. Uh, Wilson's is he survives the cold a bit better due to his massive beard. So we shall have to bear that in mind. I think the first night of the full moon we're going to go down and shave the beef. In fact, we might go down there anyway. Okay, so we're back here to the fire. Let's chuck. Oh, I'll tell you what, rather than picking dropping them on the floor, why don't we just put them on the fire? There we go. Marvellous. Okay. Right, now let's have a quick look at the magic menu while we still can. Meat effigy would be good. Pan fruit would be excellent. One man band would, uh, it would be nice. But what I want to see is the fire star. So we need a spear, we need two nightmare fuel, and we need a red crystal. There's two nightmare fuel. And there's a red crystal. In fact, there's two red crystals. A willow is about to get a new weapon.
Use a shadow manipulator to build a prototype. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, that's annoying. What do we need for the shadow manipulator? Are we in, okay, we're nowhere near ready making that. Oh, that's a shame. Okay. No fire staff for Willow then. I think I'm going to have to make her an ice staff. It's not exactly the end of the world. It's still a great weapon. Um, yeah, so we'll make a make a nice stuff. Okay. So that's that, and we shall also make now make ourselves a new spear. We need some rope for that. Okay. Purple gem. Yes, we'll probably use that later on. And okay. So we've got a new weapon out of it. Regard. It's not the one I wanted, but we now have a goal. That is the end of the day. So I shall see you all in the morning. Well, hello everyone, it's morning and it's time to get going. It's winter so we really have to make the most of every moment now. Uh, looks like we're going to need much more nightmare fuel because the shadow manipulator isn't going to do what we want it to do. Let's grab some food. Let's, yes, I did really meant to drop that. Uh, I love this game. I hate the interface when it comes to doing things like this, to be honest with you. Yeah, one pixel movement and it changes what you want to do. Right, get that. And we'll stick that on there instead. And we store that. Okay, alright, we're desperately in short of wood. We're going to go over here and get it. Uh, we'll get that back. If we can, we'll grab a couple of rocks on the way through. really love to take the time and reorganize all these but I don't think we're gonna have time to do that just yet but I should get it done during the winter somewhere okay kill the rabbits there we go so let's get a few trees going in fact new axe because this one's not gonna last very long Just enough, that's good. And grab that as well. Let's see if we can find another decent sized tree. Oh, that one will do nicely. I'm already starting to freeze. So I think that's going to colour our plans, to be honest with you. The only thing we can easily get at this point that will help us is beefalo wool. Which we go and shave off the beefalo. And they get rather annoyed if you do it while they're awake, so we're going to have to wait until they're asleep. Oh, carrot, we'll have that. Ooh, second carrot, we'll definitely have that. Right, okay, I need the two get back to base and quickly. We're starting to lose hit points now from the cold. Alright, so. Yeah, this is not going to be good. I think I might actually drop down a fire and warm us up. No, we're at this all right. Okay. Oh, just in time. There we go. Ah, oh, excellent. Poor Willow, they're freezing. Night is coming, I need fire. You stood by one. Right, we didn't get nearly as much of anything we wanted to, and we are now fairly aware that that is too far away, so... Uh, let's warm this up a little bit. Thermal stone is lit up a little bit. Let's wield this. Get ourselves some stone. we saving this one.
Okay, get these bunnies. We'll be all right here. Yeah, I don't think we're quite naughty enough for the Krampus to spawn. I do want to bear that in mind, though. I'm going to try to kill as few rabbits as possible during the, 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 the autumn for that very reason. Okay, so that's giving us some meat. Let's get back towards the fire. There we go. Eat our chili. There, that's helped us a lot. That's healed us quite a touch as well. Okay, get a little bit more heat in. Yeah, I think that's good enough. Right, harvest that. And let's get the next meal cooking. So. Um, meat. Monster meat. And a couple of last, last few carrots. There we go. Let that cook. Get back in front of the fire there. Okay, and that's probably going to be it for the day, to be honest with you. I shall see you all in the morning. Alright, it's morning. Let's get back to it. We don't have much time. We've got an awful lot to do. Now, it's occurring to me that we are starting to suffer from lack of resources. We're running out of grass again, and we've got loads up here that we should go and farm. We're running out of wood again, we've got loads down here we should farm. And we're also running short on stone, so I want to get these, these two boulders here, because what I'd like to do is I'd like to put a, uh, a fire up here. So we'll head this way first and we'll head that way next if we have time. If not, we'll do that tomorrow or in the next episode. Yes. We also need to address our food shortage and those four traps are working well for us, but they're not quite giving us enough material. So let's just have a quick look here. That should give us enough, yes, so we can make a fire like that. We need to get another eight stone to make a stone fire, which I'd like to make, so let's make that our priority. Yeah, we're not going to get enough stone out of this, are we? have a quick look around here because I know there was some loose stone down here the last time I was here. No, uh, let's have a look. Okay, so there's a, there's a stone over to the west of us. They're going to have to do that one and we're probably going to have to make a fire when we get there. There it is. Yeah, we need a fire. Let's make a fire. Go, that'll help us. So we get this stone. Alright, and now let's start concentrating on getting some wood. There we go. Nice big tree here. Need some chili. There we go. Get that last one up. Back to the fire for a sec. Yeah, that makes us feel a bit better. Okay, and then... Get this tree. And this stump. Okay, that's got us a little bit more. Okay, and that, so we can now make ourselves a fire pit. The mouse is seriously playing up. Right, okay, so. 
yet. So I only need two wood, which is great. And we're still desperately short of grass. So, right, let's get as much warmth out of this as we can. And I think that's probably all we're going to get. And then we're going to run back to base. Actually, didn't mean to do that. Uh, yes, underneath that lip. So we have wood for a couple of days. Now all we need is some more grass because amazingly even with all this grass we have run out. Which is quite scary if you stop to think about it. Okay, here we are back at base. And eat some meatballs. Kill the wabbit. Let's for that to dry. There we go. Marvellous. Out of the way. Thank you very much. Okay, there we go. That heats us up a little bit. And we shall store beef jerky. Make something to eat out of our limited supplies. Yes, we've got two meals worth of... three meals worth of food if we don't mind sacrificing a bit of sanity. That's going to be a problem, and that's something we're going to have to deal with second, I think, after our immediate cut grass shortage. But still, we're out of time now. So I think we're going to end it there. And I shall see you in the next episode where we do days 26, 27 and 28. So until then, I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Don't Starve. Thank you and good night.